Hello, if you have issues with mobile data network not working on Xiaomi 14T and 14T Pro, here's what you can do in order to try to fix this issue. So here are some general steps that you can take in order to try to fix this issue. First of all, we need to go to the settings. And first and foremost, we're gonna go to more connectivity options to check if the airplane mode is not enabled. Of course, if airplane mode is enabled, you will not be able to use mobile data. So you want to make sure that it is actually off if you want to use mobile data. Now let's go back and let's go to mobile networks. Over here you need to make sure that mobile data is turned on. This is of course the main option that allows you to use mobile data on your device. Also make sure that the SIM card is actually inserted correctly. If you cannot or if the device doesn't detect the SIM card, then it means that the SIM card was either not inserted or not inserted correctly and if you go over here then you can also make sure that you can for instance change the preferred network type uh, sometimes by accident you might have set it to like 2g or preferred 3g if you can try to use a different network type and if you go to mobile networks uh, you should also make sure that you can automatically select the network uh, the preferred network in my case it is already enabled however in your case it might it might be necessary to also use it as well now if nothing helps if none of these options help then what you can do is once again go back to more connectivity options in the settings but this time you're gonna scroll down and go to reset wi-fi mobile networks and bluetooth and then over here at the bottom you can press this reset settings arrow in order to perform complete reset of these all network settings, including Wi-Fi, mobile data and Bluetooth. Of course, this means that you will have to connect to your Wi-Fi once again, as every Wi-Fi network will be forgotten. And the same goes with Bluetooth. If you use Bluetooth devices, you will have to connect to your smartphone again. And of course, if you do that, the mobile data and settings and all things related to that will be reset to default settings. So it should help if the issue is not on the SIM cards side. And that's pretty much everything you, ch you can do in order to try to fix this issue. Thanks for watching, leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye!